Hey everyone, so today I'm going to join you my favorite face of February. Now, I haven't done a favorite face probably since October or November. I just kind of, st I forgot about them. But for February, I have been loving this so much. And it's not just because of this one palette. I have the colors in another palette anyways. But it has been using my Coastal Scents Mirage palette. And it is this really pretty green, like olivey green, taupey brown. I love, I love this look. Um, I usually tell you guys that I've probably worn this look three or five times in the month. This one, I don't even know how many times I've worn it. I've worn it so many times. It's just one of those quick looks it's still like sultry or I don't know I love it I love how it looks I don't know if it's just because I love how it looks like with my blue eyes or just the color combination with the cheeks the lips everything it just it all pulls all together and I simply love it so if you guys would like to try it go ahead and pull out either your Mirage palette it is back in stock so go ahead and hurry and get one as quick as you can before they sell out or just use whatever you have so thanks for watching, and I will see you guys soon. Bye. Okay, so I've already started out with priming my eye, and I've used the MAC Paint Pot in Soft Ochre. Now, I'm taking row 11, number 8, and it is this taupey green color. I am taking my Sigma 252 brush, which is just a large paddle brush, and I am packing the color on there. And I'm just going to place this all over my entire lid. I love this color. It is so unique. I could wear it every single day. With a large fluffy brush, this is the Sigma 2 E35, excuse me. I'm going into row 6, number 3 down. And it is this really warm brown. I'm taking that onto the brush, tapping off any excess. And I'm going to place this on the outer corner. I'm just tapping it on and then up into the crease. And then just go back and forth and blend this color in. All right, next before we add one more crease color, I'm gonna do my highlight color. It is in row one, number four, and it's this really pretty light beige color. And I use this highlight out of all of them, probably the most so far. Just taking that onto a large fluffy brush, and I'm placing that up on my brow bone. Concentrate it there. Once the color's placed, I just go back and forth across my entire brow bone and blend that color in. This really gives a really nice sheen and it has a little bit of flecks of gold glitter that I actually really like. All right, so for the last um, color for my crease, I'm taking an angled shadow brush. This is the MAC 275 and I'm going into row 10, number eight, and it's this really dark olive green. Taking just a little bit of that and tapping it off. I'm going to place this on the outer corner and then into the crease and then blend it in. So for eyeliner, I'm using my new favorite liquid liner, which is the Ulta liner. This one is in forest green. I love all the colors that I bought. Um, they are, they just glide on so nice and the colors are great. So if you guys want, you should go check them out. You can't do any swatches at the store, but there might be a few other colors and I'm probably going to pick up the rest of the colors. That's how much I actually like them. So with this, I am just doing a really thick line right across the top.
just like that. I'm also going to take this color and place it down underneath and use the green crease color that I did on top of it underneath here and kind of smudge it out. Alright, so I went ahead and I added mascara. I just did the Smoky Lash by Makeup Forever and I made them kind of chunky, not spidery looking, but more, I guess, chunky. I don't know how you suppose you want to say it. But the eyes are finished. I will zoom in and show you what they look like. So there's that. I love the lid color. It is my favorite color. And this forest green liner is so pretty. This one looks like. Such a pretty color. I love it. I love, love, love this look. Alright, also what I've been wearing on my cheeks a lot has been Mauvin Uptown by NYX. I mean NYC. It's the cream blush stick. And I'm just going to apply that to the back of my hand. Use a stippling brush. And place it on. And the cheek color that I've been wearing this month the most is in my Coastal Sense 10, piece, 10 Pan Palette. It is the very last color on the bottom row. Just taking that onto an angled Smashbox brush and tapping on top of the cream color blush just to set it. Once I've got that, I just blend it in with just a Kabuki brush just to soften out the lines and really blend it in. I've been wearing my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in Perfect Topping. Just looks like this. Just take a little bit of tap of that onto an angled brush and highlight in a C. Down my nose, my chin. And for lips, I'm using Stila Lip Glaze in Kitten. It has been one of my by far, by far one of my favorites. Alright, so this is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I'll list everything down below to go ahead and check that out. Also, a picture of this look will be over on my Facebook page. The link will be listed down below and that will take you right over to that photo. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching and let me know what your guys' favorite face of February has been or either in a video response or you guys can just tell me in the comments below like what you've been using the most or like what colors, anything like that. So thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.